Hello people. Today is another tutorial on the topic of how I made the text for my video from the concert on my Instagram. Today we will analyze it, let's go. For those who don't know, it's called grim art. It's a very popular thing. It's for those who can't draw. And so, we launch After Effects, create a composition. I do 25 frames per second. 4K, 10 seconds will be enough. We create a plain text. Write what we need. Choose a font. I take this one. Place it in the center of the composition. We will do the whole effect with the help of particles. In After Effects you can do a lot of cool things. In short, we are looking for it in a search and throw it on solid. Then repeat everything after me. There are quite a lot of values. Then you can play around with the values. You can make a lot of cool effects. After that, we throw the fill effect and change the color to the one we want. I'll choose this one. Below we throw an effect that will make our drops smoother and transform them into a more normal look. As always, mash, we add, as without it, and the last effect that will take the form of text. Next, we throw two layers into the group and add an effect that will cut off the extra drops and they will work only on our text. But as we can see, it does not work out quite correctly. Now we will fix it. We select the text area for interaction with the drops. We indicate as we want everything to flow down our liquid. It already looks more or less but we will finalize it a little more. We again make duplicate layers, throw them into the group and create an empty layer, add blur and choker to it. In order for all the effects to work exactly on one layer, add the set matte effect and select our layer. You're done. We also add a shadow to the drops so that they are voluminous. We twist all the effects a little. This is already individual, depending on your text. This text is on a transparent background. You can use this text in different projects. If you want, you can change the color. As well as throw a stroke of the letters in black so that it would be more highlighted. a little animation, and of course the glow of the entire text. In fact, that's all. You guys can experiment and change the values, or add your own effects. I just show how I do it in my projects. That's all, thank you for your attention, see you soon.